my Girl Scouts and all of our dedicated supporters. I want to thank everyone who showed their support for the Girl Scout mission this Giving Tuesday. Because of you, we exceeded our $10,000 goal, something that's never been done before with the Girl Scouts of Gateway Council. And we will be able to repair and refresh our beloved camps. Actually, you really gifted our Girl Scouts much more than a new ice maker in a boathouse. You've given a shy girl a place to meet new friends. You've inspired a future scientist and you have helped create thousands of Girl Scout camp memories. While I am a little hesitant and a little nervous, I can't think of a more worthy reason to color my hair green. So follow me through the process. Here we go. Well, what do you think? Now I can truly say that I represent Girl Scouts from my head to my toes. And maybe I'll start a new trend among the other Girl Scout CEOs. I know many of my friends and family were thrilled to see this new makeover, and I hope you are too. However, we did learn something new. Brown or brunette hair is really difficult to color green as you can probably tell. Despite the attempts to convince me not to color my hair green, a number of times actually from the salon employees, I shared with them that I am a Girl Scout and I made a commitment and Girl Scouts keep their commitments. Just as you kept your commitment to fulfill your obligation to support us during our Giving Tuesday campaign. Thank you so much for your hard work and your energy and your funds. Every day of the year, we appreciate our donors and our volunteers. With amazing Girl Scouts and supporters like you, I'm proud to be the CEO of the Girl Scouts of Gateway Council. Green, hair, and all. <laughs>